What does woman's history mean to me? I think that it's a celebration of all of the uh, chores, all of the tasks, all of the assignments that we are given on a daily basis, and we do it with a smile. You know, we, we, we are so many things to many people, and because we are nurturers, um, so many things are expected of us. There is a lady in my church, and she, she had a daughter with cerebral palsy, and that did not stop her from bringing that child to church every Sunday and the child would make little sounds, little noises, and so forth. She still brought her to church. Now that child is grown. They did not expect her to live past, you know, a young six or seven years old. And now she's a grown little lady. I've watched her over the years. And the reason why I watched her is because I, too, have a special needs daughter. Uh, my daughter has autism. So I was always trying to keep her at home, you know, so that she wouldn't act out, you know, negative behaviors. But when I saw this lady in my church who didn't keep her child at home, and she continued to work, she, she volunteers, she's, she's doing everything, and she has um, her child, who's a young lady now, well cared for, Gee, that's my hero. And I take my child everywhere now. You know, I'm not ashamed of that. Because even with working with students and so forth, my first love would have to be after God is my family. And God blessed me with this young lady. And I'm so proud of her. But I would not have thought that way had it not been for looking at this lady. And I want to call her name, Sister Carolyn Devon. My advice to my younger self is be true to who you are. Don't ever lessen what God has blessed you with. Don't do that because so many wonderful things can come out of that. Now uh, with me, uh, with all the degrees in theater, it was because of my daughter that I decided to get a doctorate in counseling. And my dissertation was how the arts, how music can improve the social skills development of children diagnosed with autism. You are a role model to someone who's looking at you, just like Carolyn was a role model to me, and she didn't even know I was looking at her. She helped me, and I hope to help other people that way.